So in addition to my big red parka and my insulated car hearts and my socks and my thermal underwear, I need to think about what's going to go on my head. And we'll start with my very greasy hair because I haven't had a shower in three weeks. You get used to that after a while. You sort of go through stages. At first it's not so bad and then all of a sudden it really bugs you and then you get over that and it's just fine. And, um, if you were to actually bathe, then you just have to start that process all over again. You might as well just settle into being kind of gross. Then you're fine. It's actually not bad to not have to take a shower. It saves a lot of time. So when I get ready to go outside or go drive around on a snowmobile and do work, I need to be prepared for the fact that it's going to be windy no matter what. And it's going to be cold on my face, so I need to cover up properly. I probably won't wear these... Uh, fancy sunglasses because they don't actually cover my face very well. So I'll take those off and squint at you because it's very bright. So the first thing is I have, actually I'll take that off, we'll start from the very beginning. I have a little hat. It's just a little beanie that ties on a string so that if I take it off I won't lose it in the wind. And then on top of that I have a hoodie on underneath my clothes or underneath my outer layer. I can put that hood on. Another layer. Layers are good. So you can they trap air in between them, which helps keep you warm. This is a neck gaiter that I'm putting on. And actually it's supposed to go the other way. I'll show you. I've had this for a long time. There it is. And I think that you're supposed to wear it with the neck part down cover your neck, but I find it works better if I do it like this and cover my nose. So I'm going to put that over my head. If it was really cold, I'd put another one on, or if I was doing a long traverse or something, I'd put another one on over top of this. I'm going to pull it up so it goes over my nose. Then I'm going to put my hood on, my nice warm hood, and then over top of that, goggles. So now this is very important. I have to get my, I have to trap the top of my hood in my goggles so no wind can get in there. And then I'm going to mess around. There's a wire that goes in the hood so I can get it all adjusted nicely. And of course I want to be fashionable out here so I'm going to turn this part out and, so that I look my best. And then I'm going to tuck my neck gaiter up underneath my goggles and I'm going to make sure that it's all nice and tucked in the side. I'm going to twist this in so it's nice and tight, get it adjusted so I can see, and then I have to zip up my coat, which can be a struggle because sometimes the zipper doesn't work. And I have to put on my gloves again. And actually, I'd have another pair of gloves also if it was really cold, but they're in my ECW bag right now. Put my mittens on, over my little gloves. I'm ready to go.